All right, we finally have a new event, Tower of Trials, which is a very important event for newer players. If you are a newer player watching this video, this video is basically dedicated to you because most older players already know about this. But the event, Tower of Trial, although very easy, has some very, very specific missions that can only be done in these event, Tower of Trials, that if you don't do them right now, you're going to be like, oh my god, I'm going to have to wait months for the next one. Uh, and it's basically a must if you are a Reinhardt player. In the title section, you can uh, scroll down. And of course, if you haven't done it yet, you will see uh, additional 4% HP when eating HP food, which is a must if you actually, you know, are someone that's using Reinhardt at all. Um, it's very, very important. And the challenges are very simple, but, you know, they can actually be kind of annoying because they are time gated. The first one... Uh, it's to just beat Event Tower of Trials three times. The, my free-to-play account I'm using right here is very new, so I've only done it once, actually. The second one is beat the... Oh, it actually just says it. Beat the last floor uh, with three SR characters. This one can be a little tricky if you don't have investment in SR characters, but it's it's fairly easy. Uh, the third one, I think, is just do it. Yeah, do the, the last floor in one attempt. Again, pretty simple. Then, <laughs> this one's funny. <laughs> fail two times in the first floor. This one's pretty tricky if you only have level 60 characters, but uh, if you're a newer player, you probably have some level 1 characters. And then this one is just uh, fail the last floor 20 times. So it should be fairly simple. I'm going to do some here uh, for me because I actually, again, this is my uh, newer account. And for the first floor, for the first mission, I'm just going to go in with a level 1 character. This does cost stamina, so you can just, if you don't want to spend uh, pots, you can do this throughout multiple days. You have like two weeks to do this, but I would recommend getting these missions done. Because again, you can only do this every few months. And next time it's going to come back, we don't even know. So let me just fail this two times and then come back for the next mission. When it comes to just climbing the tower as fast as possible, it's simple, just use, you know, as much AoE DPS as you can. Although for this tower specifically, I've seen a text right there that says, uh, I don't know if it's going to show here. Uh, Pierce is reduced to 0%, so I guess they they just want people to not be able to use a Pierce team because it's really fast. But Pierce is not the only option. I'm using King right here, but Shin... Uh, honestly, Hauser. <laughs> These stages are so easy that any AoE team will do. You just, again, gotta make sure that once you get to the, uh... Oh, okay. It was only the first two stages. I guess you can use Pierce, just not specific stages. Uh, Trader Meliodas then, even Blue DM Meliodas, just use AoE and you should be good to go. Rich the end here, um, I kept the same team that I was using. Uh, all the stages can be debuffed by Green Arthur's Holy Relic, so if you want to use that. And Pierce uh, should work for the uh, last stages, because um, I wasn't really paying attention, but I didn't see any of the stages uh, lowering your Pierce either. I was just kind of autoing while doing something else. Um, at the last stage, so if you want to do the, the missions, obviously, beat a full SR, um, and obviously lose 20, time, 20 times, you can't do lose 20 times and obviously beat in the first try at the same time. Uh, but uh, if you want to lose 20 times, if that's the mission you want to do right now, you cannot just back out. You need to actually die. So go in with a low level character, um, preferably, you know, just an ungeared character, just one character. It doesn't need to be a level one character like in the first stage because uh, these enemies hit hard enough that even a level 60 character should be able to die fairly easily. Uh, and it only counts if you just die. If you back out, like if you go in with your team and you forfeit, it does not count for the mission. Um, I would know because that's what I was doing. Uh, <laughs> and it wasn't counting, so make sure to do that. I'm not going to do all 20 right now. I'm going to do like uh, three more just to exhaust my stamina here. And again, you don't need to do all 20 right away because it will cost you like uh, what, four, uh, 200 stamina. You can just do over the course of multiple uh, days. And because I can't do all the missions today anyways, because I have to beat the tower one more time regardless, I will just do this a few more times and then do my SR mission. But yeah, don't forfeit, just let a character die. Now for the you know last mission, the SR character mission is very simple. If I'm not mistaken, you can bring one of the SRs in the back. So just bring a good SSR and you should be okay. I'm bringing Reinhardt, but obviously this, this stage is a joke. 
if you have like a, a decent character overall, so even like Green Escalar should be able to beat this with no problems. Um, just bring a decent SSR. I have, you know, Red Slater only because I, I, I don't have SRs built. Like SRs aren't good, you know, for the most part. SR is kind of cracked, so she's very, very useful, but she's still really, really good in PvP if you use her with Reinhardt and stuff, but um, in general, SR characters are pretty bad, so I, I don't just have SR characters built or anything. Um, so my, you know, level 80 Slayer, which I assume for most players, it's like, why would you even have SR characters built, right? So, uh, for what I've seen, on this stage, yeah, if you don't one-shot them, they actually full heal. So you need to one-shot them, so bringing single target characters uh, would be best. So not King, Festival King, should, shouldn't be the best here. Um, I guess Trader Mally's still good, right? Because he has the single target still, so Trader Mally's probably very good. Oh, he can be debuffed. Oh, Slayer is cracked then. You can attack Lord. Let's. Let's, uh, he has revives, so let's kill him. And then debuff. Or oh, I could have pushed Reinhardt ultimate, actually. I'm bringing SR Jericho just because it's just decent DPS. He cleansed one of the debuffs, but I still attack Lord. So yeah, pretty simple. Especially because one of the SRs can be used in the back, so you just bring a good SSR, and it should be more than good enough. Unless I'm wrong, and if I'm wrong, we're gonna find out right now. <laughs> but I don't think I'm wrong. I think one of the SRs can be in the back. I believe so. And I was correct, one of the SRs can in fact be in the back, so just bring a good SSR and you should be okay. Um, so yeah, next time the tower comes back I can finally get this, which is good, because I personally do use Reinhardt in PvP. So, uh, you just finish one more time and then I'll get the, uh, the other uh, losses as well, so don't miss out, or you're gonna be mumps and mumps without this.